we're getting ready to go skiing. I have my ski gear. This is my first time skiing. I've already fallen like five times, but this place is so beautiful. So many pretty things. I We have our class um, maybe like an hour from now, and hopefully I'll be able to master this because I really want to try and get on the swings on the lift. I really want to try and get on the lift. Um, so yeah, that's kind of my goal for today to try and get on the lift and try to not die but thankfully like why so, so I'll show you a little bit about so I have a Columbia jacket in teal which you know is my favorite color but yeah I'll take some more shots Hey 
Hey guys, so this is our little cabin in Ruidoso, New Mexico. It's called the Treetop Cabin. It's at the end of the street and you're literally among the treetops. This is a beautiful, beautiful view. This is the last day we're here because my camera didn't have enough battery on the first day and we got here very dark. So the apartment is a little bit messy in the bedrooms, but I'll, I'll show you guys around. So. You have a little seating area here with more beautiful view. This is like all cabins in this area. So beautiful. And then we go inside. Sorry. And then this is like a little coat closet and cleaning closet area. This is the fireplace area. We did two fireplaces. Um, I have some footage of our fireplace last night um, that I'll put in here somewhere. And then the view from the living room. And then this is the living area. We have the dining area, a little seating area here, and then this is the sunroom. This is the sunroom. It's actually pretty cold in here um, most of the time. And then out here, you have a little balcony with a barbecue and then more amazing views of the woods. I might need to do a voiceover since the, boy the boys are in there. And this is like a little patio area that you can get to from the basement. And these are the stairs to the lower level like a very small spiral staircase. It's getting very dark in here. I'll turn on some lights. So you have another little like family room in this area. It's very nice and quaint. We've got some movies. There's a laundry room here in case that you need it to. There's another little dining area here. And then this is the area that goes to like the back patio. So you've got the stairs. And then you've got this little little patio area here. Isn't it beautiful, guys? It's just, I think it's simply breathtaking. So then here you have the, sec uh, the second bedroom. In the lower floor, this is where we stayed at. You have really nice rustic decor. You have a really nice long walk-in closet. And then you have small bathroom here and yeah that's pretty much the lower level so this is the kitchen area you have a full kitchen all the appliances it's fully stocked you have a dishwasher more beautiful views from the kitchen And living area. We have a pantry. We have a full bathroom here as well. And then the other bedroom, which has a nice closet. And then it's very nice and quaint. Yeah. 
Hey guys, so I look like super tired because we woke up not that long ago and I'm also exhausted but I was nice to show you guys around and um, we definitely want to come back to this place because it's absolutely beautiful. Um, but I hope you enjoyed it and yeah, we'll see what else I put in this vlog.
we went to dinner here yesterday and it was so good. We actually came the last time we were here. It was pretty awesome as well. This is called the Mercantile. Amazing. Hunt and Harvest is the restaurant. So good. And yeah, this, so this whole main street is like most of the town. It's so pretty. They have some more stores. It's just a beautiful place. So this is another one of my favorite stores here. It's called Old Barrel Tea. It's a tea shop and they have so many cool things. Aquaponics. Lots of natural products. stop here at, in Alamogordo they have like the world's largest pistachio stat um, like statue structure or whatever they have a nice little pistachio farm with like ice cream and stuff so it's called McGinn's pistachio tree ranch country store So I think we're gonna stop here for some pictures and some ice cream and then we'll keep on heading home.